With the rollout of the COVID-19 vaccine in the U.S. just days away now, we wanted to let you know about COVID vaccine scams. It could be dangerous, obviously, to your health. Yeah, so NBC7's Amari Fleming spoke with a UC San Diego professor who's really been the lead in tracking these potentially dangerous scams uh, to find out what you need to know. Researchers at UC San Diego say those fake claims come in waves. So when the pandemic began, what they saw were claims of cures and also fake testing kits. Now what they're seeing, a plethora of this right here, fake COVID-19 vaccines. A lot of them are talking about you need to get your order now before it's too late, before the product's not available. UC San Diego School of Medicine professor Tim Mackey giving us a look at posts from online scammers, some from overseas, preying on people desperate to get a dose of the COVID-19 vaccine. COVID is for scammers you know, a bonanza. You can't be a scammer and not be in the COVID scamming business. Like this is, this is your time to shine. Mackie is the lead author on this study released a few months ago. It shows an increase in posts online touting fake COVID-19 products for sale. Now he's seeing a wave of fake vaccines. This was actually a dark web uh, marketplace that we found selling this vaccine product. He says most times they're just trying to scam you out of your money, but if you do receive a fake vaccine, it could be worse. If they do take a vaccine that's not effective, they could also obviously have side effects associated with that. Uh, there could be sterility issues with a vaccine needle that could infect you with another disease. And also, of course, you're going to engage in behavior that may make you more susceptible to actually getting COVID. But once the vaccine's released, Mackey warns there's also the black market danger. There's a lot of pharmaceutical companies that are worried about the security of their product, like people actually just reselling uh, legitimate vaccines or maybe even reselling spoiled vaccines because so much of it is going to be temperature controlled. Omari Fleming, NBC7. And uh, Professor Mackey says another concern is making sure the vaccine vials are properly disposed because they could potentially be reused for fake vaccine doses. Experts say any vaccine you get should only be through a licensed medical professional, and most health departments will publish a list of approved COVID vaccine providers.